Statin side effects Lipitor, Zoka, Crestor. Statins are a class of medications primarily used to lower high levels of cholesterol in the blood. They are one of the most commonly prescribed drugs for managing high cholesterol, a risk factor for cardiovascular diseases, such as heart attacks and strokes. Statins work by inhibiting the enzyme HMG-CoA reductase, which plays a key role in the production of cholesterol in the liver. By reducing the liver's production of cholesterol, statins help lower overall cholesterol levels in the bloodstream. Here are some common statin medications. 1. Atorvastatin, Lipitor. 2. Simvastatin, Zoka. 3. Rosuvastatin, Crestor. 4. Pravastatin, Provachol. 5. Lovastatin, Mevacor. 6. Fluvastatin, Leskal. 7. Pitavastatin, Lavalo. Statins are typically prescribed when lifestyle changes, such as dietary modifications and increased physical activity, are insufficient to manage high cholesterol levels. They are considered safe and effective for many people, but they can have potential side effects, so it's important for individuals to discuss their use with a healthcare provider and have regular checkups to monitor their cholesterol levels and any possible side effects. Common side effects can include muscle pain, digestive issues, and in rare cases, more serious side effects such as liver problems. Side effects of statins. 1. Muscle pain and weakness. This is one of the most frequently reported side effects. It may range from mild discomfort to more severe muscle pain, known as myalgia. In rare cases, statins can lead to a serious condition called rhabdomyolysis, in which muscle cells break down, releasing a protein into the bloodstream that can harm the kidneys. 2. Digestive issues. Some people may experience gastrointestinal problems, such as nausea, diarrhea, or constipation. 3. Headache. Headaches are a less common side effect but can occur in some individuals taking statins. Less common or rare side effects. 1. Liver problems. Statins can affect liver function, leading to elevated liver enzymes in a small percentage of people. Regular liver function tests are typically recommended for individuals taking statins. 2. Memory and cognitive issues. There have been reports of cognitive problems, such as memory loss or confusion, in some individuals taking statins, although this is not well documented and remains a subject of debate among healthcare professionals. 3. Increased blood sugar. Statins may slightly raise blood sugar levels, which could be a concern for people with diabetes or those at risk of developing diabetes. 4. Skin reactions. Skin rash or itching can occur in some cases. 5. Increased risk of diabetes. There is some evidence to suggest that long-term use of statins may be associated with a slightly increased risk of developing type 2 diabetes, particularly in individuals with pre-existing risk factors for diabetes. Before we move on, would you please help us out? If you like this type of content please hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and turn on notifications. It really helps us on YouTube and helps others see our content. Also check out the description section below for special information to help you in your health journey. How does statins work? Statins work by inhibiting an enzyme called HMG-CoA reductase, which plays a key role in the production of cholesterol in the liver. By blocking this enzyme, statins reduce the amount of cholesterol that the liver produces. Here's a step-by-step -step explanation of how statins work. 1. Cholesterol production. Cholesterol is a type of fat that is essential for the normal functioning of the body. 1. The liver is the primary organ responsible for producing cholesterol. Cholesterol is important for building cell membranes and making certain hormones. 2. HMG-CoA reductase. To produce cholesterol, the liver uses an enzyme called HMG-CoA reductase. This enzyme is involved in the early stages of cholesterol synthesis. 3. Inhibition of HMG-CoA reductase. Statins are medications that are designed to inhibit the activity of HMG-CoA reductase. They do this by binding to the enzyme and preventing it from functioning effectively. 4. Reduced cholesterol production. When HMG-CoA reductase is inhibited by statins, the liver produces less cholesterol. This leads to a decrease in the amount of cholesterol that is released into the bloodstream. As a result, the overall cholesterol levels in the blood are lowered. 5. Increased LDL receptor activity. In addition to reducing cholesterol production, statins also increase the activity of LDL receptors on the surface of liver cells. LDL receptors are responsible for removing low-density lipoprotein, LDL, often referred to as bad cholesterol, from the bloodstream. This further reduces the levels of LDL cholesterol in the blood. 6. 
lowering LDL cholesterol, by decreasing the production of cholesterol and increasing the removal of LDL cholesterol from the blood, statins effectively lower the levels of LDL cholesterol in the bloodstream. This, in turn, reduces the risk of atherosclerosis, the buildup of plaque in the arteries, and its associated cardiovascular diseases, including heart attacks and strokes. How to reduce side effects of statins? If you're experiencing side effects from statin medication, it's important to discuss this with your healthcare provider. They can offer guidance tailored to your specific situation. However, here are some general tips that may help reduce side effects. 1. Communication with your healthcare provider. Share your concerns and any specific side effects you're experiencing with your healthcare provider. They can provide personalized advice and may consider adjusting the dosage or trying a different statin. 2. Regular checkups. Attend regular follow-up appointments with your healthcare provider to monitor your cholesterol levels and check for any signs of side effects. 3. Lifestyle modifications. Adopting a heart-healthy lifestyle can complement the effects of statin medication and may reduce the risk of side effects. This includes a balanced diet, regular exercise, maintaining a healthy weight, and avoiding smoking. 4. Take medication as directed. Follow your healthcare provider's instructions for taking your statin medication. Some statins are best taken in the evening, as cholesterol production tends to be highest during the night. 5. Coenzyme Q10, COC10, supplements. Some people find that taking COC10 supplements can help alleviate muscle-related side effects. COC10 is a compound that plays a role in producing energy in cells and may be depleted by statin use. 6. Consider lower doses or alternatives. Your healthcare provider may adjust the dosage of your current statin or recommend trying a different type of statin. Different statins may have varying effects on individuals, so finding the right one for you is important. 7. Monitor for liver function. Regular liver function tests can help detect any potential issues related to liver function, which can be affected by statin use. 8. Stay hydrated. Adequate hydration can help prevent muscle cramps and other discomforts that may be associated with statin use. 9. Report any unusual symptoms promptly. If you experience severe or unusual symptoms, especially related to muscle pain or weakness, contact your healthcare provider right away. This could be a sign of a more serious side effect. 10. Consider a statin holiday. In some cases, a statin holiday, a temporary break from the medication, may be recommended to evaluate if the side effects improve. This should only be done under the guidance of a healthcare provider. Remember, never stop taking your statin medication without consulting your healthcare provider. They can provide the best advice on how to manage any side effects you may be experiencing. Disclaimer, always check with your doctor before trying anything, especially if you are on medication. This information is just to be used as general knowledge and not medical advice. Thanks for watching our video. Please hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, and turn on the notification button so you don't miss a video. Also, tell us your results from using Niacin.